everyone. Today I am going to share with you how to create an app that may help you to record your daily electricity usage and how to create an informative chart to monitor the daily electricity usage. Let's see how it works. First, it is a histogram chart that shows the daily usage, each of the bar showing the usage on that day. While further click on the bar, it's showing the detail. I also created a deck view in the menu, which listing all the records which sorting by captured date. The latest record will always be shown on the top. The app allows us to add new record either in deck view or chart view. There are two data to be input, the meter image and the reading. For this version, we required to manually enter the reading. After a few data recorded, at least five records, the more the best, we may enhance the app by implementing the OCR. With the OCR, we can speed up data entry by automatically filling out the reading from the meter image. I will share the OCR in the next video. Let's proceed for the workshop now. Let's check the data. First, the record ID column. Record ID column is the key with text as type. We don't want it to be shown, so we uncheck the show option. Then set the initial value as unique it. Next column, the date time column. The date time column, set the type as date time. And with an initial value of now. Next, the image column. Set the type as image and set it as required field. Next, the reading column. Set it as number type and set it as a required field. Next, the differ reading virtual column. Create a new virtual column as number type. With a formula of getting the difference between the current reading with the last reading. And the rest, let it as default. Next, the capture date virtual column. This virtual column is extracting the date from the date time column. And the last column, captured time. It extracting the time from the date time column. All right, data is now ready. Let's proceed to the user interface. First, the primary views, the electricity daily usage chart. Set the data source from TNV table. Set the view as chart. Then set the position as left. Then set the chart type as horizontal histogram. Set the group aggregate as sum of Dura reading. Then set the chart column as captured date and captured time. Then enable the show legend option. We may further change the icon for the view. Done, let's proceed to next view. In the menu view, I have created a similar view. This view is mainly to list all record and sorting by date. This view is sourced from TNB table, view type is deck and position as menu, and then set the sort by as date time column with descending mode, so that the latest record will always on top. Next, set the display content as this. And disable the action bar. Done, let's proceed to next view the TNB form view. In this view, we just need to set the column order as image and reading. While the rest leave as default. The last view, the TNB detail view. For this view, we will use the card layout. Just set the information that required to display in the detail view. The apps actually is ready. 
but we may further beautify the app via the setting and brand. Like changing the theme, use a custom logo. Change the header and footer. And then further tuning the app in options. Like setting the starting view, enable the advanced forms automatically. And lastly, disable the allow image input from gallery. So that whenever we open an image entry, it will auto turn on the camera. The app now is ready. Lastly, don't forget to save and verify your data. Completed.